There is a major change to tell you about in the financial aid process that parents and students are going to need to know. This Saturday is when students can start submitting the FAFSA form for the 2017-2018 school year. Kate Raditz is here with more on that. Good morning, Kate. Good morning, Kim. Yes, FAFSA stands for Free Application for Federal Student Aid. Usually, the filing period begins January 1st, but this year, for the first time, applications are going to be accepted starting October 1st. And it's very important to get that application in early because some financial aid is awarded uh, first come first serve. So the money could be gone by the time students finally get their FAFSA filed. All students should file the FAFSA, not just families with financial hardships. Some schools give students free money just for filling out the form and we're not talking about only high school seniors. So here are some things you can do now to get prepared. Find your 2015 federal tax returns. This is for students and parents. Have recent bank statements handy and you should know your social security numbers and driver license numbers. Now it is free to fill out the FAFSA form and you can do it online. We'll put a link to that website at WCCO.com slash link. So sounds like want to get started early if you yeah, can. Yeah, and it is a process that so many families <gasps> dread. I remember doing that. It was when good I was times, in Kim. Yeah, yes. But, uh, yeah, it's got to be done. It it does. All right, thanks, Kate. Yeah.